So let me tell you why the rich man, the prime minister, the president, let me tell you why they're breeding bunkers. Because, because there is a wall war. Everybody going to feel it. And, and over 10 years, I was one of the people in the Caribbean. I say, plant your food, plant your food. So when the boat, boat and cargo ships and plane cannot fly, you can't get food in the Caribbean coming from foreign. So plant your food. People in Grenada, you have good soil. Plant your food, plant your yam, plant your dashing, plant your tanya. Plant everything like you're crazy. All on the riverbank, just plant food. Just plant food, banana trees, everything. Plant on the riverbank, we have good soil. Just plant food like you're crazy. So that war, that wall water coming up there wouldn't affect you. That's why the leaders building bunkers. Because when the war start, you, you affect everything. You, you, you won't have any police officers again. You won't have any police officers when that war starts fighting. Because that war, all countries going to be fighting. This war going to become lawless again. You won't have law, the law won't involve in this thing again. No police again. So this war, when it start, there will be no police. And all the soldiers going to be busy protecting themselves. <laughs> so, think about it. You could do what you want. I could do what I want. When the war break out. So, that's why they're creating bunkers. When the, the Prime Minister go down in the bunker and the racket, he shot it. Just like a, a vault in the, um, in the bank. When they're creating bunkers, for, for the protection from us because they won't have no protection no security um sec uh, no, no security working for them anymore everybody will be trying to protect their own self because this war coming it will impact on everybody now after this war you, after the war finish then you will come back to gold and silver you come back to gold and silver, and then, then we could look look out for the man that had to come, the man or the guy calling Jesus, but his name wouldn't be Jesus, you know. But after this big war, but look at look at how close it is, the war is about to start. So people, repent, ask for forgiveness. Every day after forgiveness, 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 after forgiveness. Because we're close. This is the last war. Yeah? The last war. The war that coming up there. What are they fighting now? What Israel and the Palestinians and Russia and um, Ukraine. And you go, you're going to spread. It's spreading already. Finally, you're going to come to North America. So, you know how much people are waiting, are waiting to take away the Prime Minister during a war? You know what people are waiting to take out the president during a war? So that's why they're building bunkers, guys. For their protection. Not for no dooms they are coming. They're building bunkers to protect themselves from the poor people. Because when the war starts, there will be no police officers anymore. No security. Ah, everybody going to look out for themselves at this time. No cargo boat coming. No cargo plane. You'll be hungry. Peace out.